Hi, my name is Kate Griffiths from Whole Self Leadership and I'm coming on today because I wanted to share with you some thoughts about the myth of insignificance. So often you can feel really insignificant. Who are you in this world full of people? And even as I was preparing to share this with you today, I saw a post on LinkedIn from a marketing coach that I follow is going, oh wow, I've got 7,000 connections. And part of me was like, well, I don't have 7,000 connections on LinkedIn. But it doesn't really matter. You can have one connection, a hundred, a thousand, 10,000. It's really how you're showing up in that moment. And that's what we need to remember. And what I wanted to share with you today was a quote by Rumi, where he says, you are not a drop in the ocean, rather the entire ocean in a drop. So let's consider what that means. And to help us with that, I've got a beautiful colour bottle because as you know, you may know I work with colour to give people greater insights into you know who they are becoming. So the bottle today is this one. So take a good look, look at those colours. Notice what comes up for you, how it makes you feel, what associations or memories you have with those colours, whether you like them or not. And censor nothing because it's all information. And really, it's, you know, the reason I wanted to talk about this and it came up is because turquoise, which is the colour in the top fraction of that bottle, has a real watery element to it. So it felt to me that these two ideas go together. So I wanted to expand it further by sharing a story with you. I recently found myself reading a play by J.B. Priestley called An Inspector Calls, partly because my daughter is studying it for GCSE and um, I wanted to refresh myself, remind myself of what it's all about as a story. And in essence, there are five main characters and there is a woman who takes her own life, really tragically, by drinking a whole load of disinfectant. And this comes about because of the actions of each of the other characters in the play. And of course, as is often the case in life, none of them are aware of the involvement of the others, but they all have a part to play. So I wanted to remind you of that, not because of the horrific nature of it, but more because if your life feels insignificant or humdrum and there's not much that that's happening, that is a lie. Because in every moment, every action you take has an impact on somebody else or on others, but often we don't see the ripples of those actions. And the essence of J.B. Priestley's work can be summed up in this phrase which appears in the play. We are all from one body or we are all of one body. Because whether you can see it or not, there is an interconnection between all things. And the, that is the value again of this bottle that I showed you earlier, the turquoise over the copper. Because it 
more than any other bottle in the colour mirror system. It really helps you to connect deeply to your intuitive knowing, that voice inside of you, that wise woman, a wise man, who knows? Beyond all of the outer certainty that we see in this world. And it can help you unblock some of that if you've got stuck. And copper, as we know, is really about helping you to feel more safe or safer in this world because you are a part of this world and you chose to be here at this time and your mere presence is having an impact on others. So never forget that and remember that some shifts can only occur at the energetic frequency, which is why colour is such a powerful tool, because it can help to really shift consciousness. So if you want to know more, leave a comment and I will respond or reach out and get in touch. And wherever you are, whatever you're doing, I wish you a wonder filled week and I look forward to seeing you soon. Go well.